Meantime, as stated by Bank Indonesia Governor, Indonesia's e-commerce transaction value is projected to reach 530 trillion rupiah in 2022. And to support achievement of the forecasted value, the central bank is committed to driving improvement in four areas, including infrastructure. Indonesia's e-commerce transactions value is projected to reach 530 trillion rupiah in 2022, Bank of Indonesia Governor Perry Wargio stated. The governor reiterated the central bank's commitment to driving improvement in full areas to support achievement of the forecasted value and maximize the potential offered by the e-commerce sector. E-commerce yang tahun depan uh, sekitar 530 triliun tahun ini 403. We are faster growing. Dan ini adalah market yang banyak. What need to be done to be faster? Ya, Pak. Four point. One adalah infrastruktur connectivity. Of course digital connectivity emas. But digital connectivity we will not get the use of the market of retail physical connectivity. Fintech cannot grow without e-commerce because who will be reaching the market? E-commerce, right? The government remains committed to boosting the development of infrastructure, including of transportations and logistics, to ensure nationwide coverage of digital infrastructures and access. Improvement in infrastructure of the digital ecosystem, including the digital banking system, financial technology system, and e-commerce infrastructure was the second area of focus highlighted by Wargeo. Integrations of the three system is a must, the governor remarked, adding that the financial technology system is dependent on the digital banking infrastructure as its backbone, and e-commerce plays its role in expanding its user reach. The central bank has applied reform in the payment system, being the third area to be improved to boost the e-commerce transactions infrastructure in Indonesia, he affirmed. IDX Channel reports.